guys, and welcome to another Get Ready With Me, this time for Valentine's Day. You know, the way I see it, you don't need any special relationship to set aside time to make yourself feel beautiful. So I've teamed up with several other YouTubers. Their links are below, so definitely check them out. But without any further ado, let's jump into the video. Starting off every look, as I do, with a little bit of primer. I will put links to some of these products down in the description box. That's Laura Mercier that I am using right there. Just a little primer on the nose, cheeks, and forehead to get ready for the foundation. Using a beauty blender, just putting tiny little dots of the makeup all over the face, and then slowly but surely blending everything in. If you guys have any recommendations for other beauty blenders, please leave them below. And then after that, I take a little bit of setting powder and just set the first, you know, base coat of foundation with a light fluffy brush. And then moving on to a little bit of under eye concealer. And then if I have any breakouts, I will check my face and make sure those are covered as well. Taking my Kabuki brush, you guys have seen this in all of my makeup videos, I am obsessed with it. I just like to fill in under the eyes and kind of lighten those areas. This is a brand new brush that I've added. It just adds a little bit extra setting powder under the eyes. Moving on with my Anastasia Soft Brown Eyebrow Pencil. I just lightly fill in the gaps in my natural eyebrow arch. I do think that eyebrows really help frame the face, but I don't like to make mine super thick. After that, obviously, moving on to a nice soft brown eyeliner. Believe it or not, that actually just came from the Victoria's Secret checkout line. It's nothing special. It's one of those like dollar eyeliner pencils, but it's worked really well. And then just a little bit of a soft pink in eyeshadow. I always fill in the full crease of the eye, and then after it's filled in evenly, I will put a darker color in the corner creases of both eyes. It just kind of helps, you know, make the eye pop and just have a nice look to it. And then of course, another coat of powder. This time it is my Bare Minerals because it's got, you know, a little bit more coverage. Excuse me, and some SPF in there as well. And then right here, just a touch of bronzer. I will have some blush after this, so I just do a light, light coat. Moving on, nothing surprising here. I'm using my Double Tube Mascara, but I just used the primer on that one. Then I use my Too Faced Mascara right here. I do wanna try the version of this mascara that is waterproof, because I've heard a lot of good things about it, but this is my Too Faced Mascara in the darkest black. And then moving on to a little L'Oreal Lip Stay Dark Red. I think the dark red gives it kind of a romantic look. And that's what we're going for here on Valentine's Day, of course. And I am not gifted in putting on lipstick, so I'm always going back and making sure that everything is cleaned up around the edge of the lips. Like, seriously, not good at it. Like at all. Ever. And then this is my e.l.f. Blush and Highlighter. This is actually the newest part of my makeup collection. It just adds a nice finishing touch and a little bit of shimmer onto the cheeks. And with that, my makeup look is complete. I was going for more of just a natural, simple beauty look. I didn't want anything that was super caked on. I wanted to kind of highlight the eyes and have dark lip. Once again, this is a collaboration video, so make sure to check out all the other channels down below. We have all shared our favorite looks for Valentine's Day. And also, there will be a new video up on this channel every day for the week of Valentine's, from what not to do if you're single, to story time videos, to manicure routines. There's a little bit of everything coming up every day this week, so if you've not yet subscribed, click the little red subscription button, and I will see you guys in the next one.